TikTok is an amazing platform for discovery. So these users are scrolling through and they are excited to learn, to discover, to see the new, to see the new brands, the new creators. We have given you the full attention of users. What are you guys' brands gonna do with that? What happens on TikTok does not stay on TikTok. If something goes viral on TikTok, everybody's talking about it. Anybody who's on TikTok remember feta pasta? There was one creator that made one video on how to make this easy feta pasta. This went viral. People were making the feta pasta. They're talking about the feta pasta. The feta pasta is being talked about at the dinner table and feta across North America sold out. We sold out not a brand of feta, we sold out feta. Hello and welcome to the D2C Podcast, I'm Eric Dick. For today's all-killer, no-filler edition, we're serving up a TikTok exclusive. One of the highlights of our Vancouver live event in May was that TikTok's brand partnership manager and her team flew up from Toronto to rub elbows and speak at the event. Meet Andrea D. Demizio from TikTok. In this short but super informative presentation, Andrea lays out exactly what it is that makes TikTok such a unique opportunity for marketers and provides some very interesting data regarding the halo effect that TikTok has on all your other marketing efforts. With over a billion monthly active users consuming a feature length movie worth of content every single day, this talk should get you fired up for the TikTok opportunity. I hope you enjoy it as much as I did. On with the show. Imperfect Foods, Instacart, Nespresso, and Coach all use Coley to generate TikTok videos that are on brand, on budget, and on time. As one of TikTok's first creative partners, Coley has the track record, know how, and tools to help you TikTok your way to short form glory. And now you can tap into that exclusive expertise with Coley's TikTok Creative Brief template. It has all the steps you need for successful creator collaborations and best practices to create fun and engaging TikToks. Head to coley.com slash TikTok to download your free copy and start creating TikToks for your brand that people actually want to watch. That's C-O-H-L-E-Y dot com slash TikTok. So, so amazing uh, to see everybody here tonight. Uh, I've already had some great conversations with people. Really looking forward to having so many more. Uh, when I was talking to Eric pre-talking about all of this, he said, you know, what do you want to do when you get there? Like, what is your purpose? Uh, and I'm here to tell you guys a little bit about TikTok. We'll have a quick TikTok chat. <laughs> uh, so I'll do some top-level TikTok stuff. But at the end of the day, I wanted to hear this. This was amazing. Uh, these are the conversations I have with my clients every day, one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, and to hear you guys talk about that, it was absolutely incredible. So thank you guys, uh, the whole panel. So good. Uh, so at TikTok, I am a brand partnerships manager uh, in the performance marketing space. What does that mean? Uh, in the past year that I've been with TikTok, I have had the opportunity to work with hundreds of brands to onboard them onto the TikTok platform. It's a bit of like a mystical space right now, I feel. Everybody's kind of TikTok curious or TikTok starting. So again, I'm so excited to tell you guys a little bit about TikTok today, but then afterwards, please come approach me, please come chat with me. I'm gonna drop awful TikTok trending like sounds. I'm gonna say Ankha Jams. I'm like, <laughs> if you don't get it, I'm gonna make you download the platform or I'm going to explain the whole trend to you so you choose your own adventure. So we'll get into some TikTok stuff. Uh, we'll talk about where we've come from, how far we've gone, uh, what makes our platform unique. And when we're talking about what makes our platform unique, I want you guys as brands to really think about how you can show up on the platform in a way that is real to our platform, in a way that's authentic to our platform, because that's what our platform's all about. It's about authenticity, it's about realness. Uh, and because I am in a room full of marketers, we are also going to talk about how we fit into your media mix, the good stuff. So getting into about us, where we are, our audiences are currently watching a movie's length on average per day of TikToks. Is anybody on TikTok, TikTok users? And can you confirm? And are you 22? 
Thank you. Uh, it's such an amazing platform where you do get to spend a lot of time exploring, enjoying, and everybody's For You feed is different. We'll talk a little bit about the For You feed in a second. Uh, but yes, a movie's length of time. And we're starting to see audiences move from other platforms onto TikTok. One third of our TikTok audiences have said that they've reduced watching time on other platforms. So TV, online video, streaming, we're starting to see people move their eyeballs to TikTok for a movie's length of time. So the eyeballs are moving. We see that. Uh, why? Why? What's so special about our platform? Whoever's spending like two hours a day can tell me, but we've broken it down into three things. Thing number one, community. I know we have talked a ton about community today, and I think that TikTok does such a good job of being authentic within the community. Uh, whether a creator has 500 followers, whether they have 5 million followers, they are a TikTok creator. And these creators are making content that then goes onto the platform and feeds into the For You feed. This is where we're spending the time. So this puts me into our second pillar, discovery. TikTok is an amazing platform for discovery. Content is purely curated for you. The For You feed is an endless stream of content that is curated for you. Nobody's TikTok feed, your For You feed is the same. They're all custom tailored to you. So you have an audience that is going on to stream through hundreds of videos within their two hours. And anybody who's a little bit obsessed with data like me, that's a bunch of signals. So these users are scrolling through and they are excited to learn, to discover, to see the new, to see the new brands, the new creators. We have given you the eyes, the ears, and the full attention of users. What are you guys as brands gonna do with that? <laughs> I love the ideas, we'll chat about this. Our third pillar is culture. What happens on TikTok? does not stay on TikTok. If something goes viral on TikTok, everybody's talking about it. Uh, do you guys remember Feta Pasta? Anybody who's on TikTok remember Feta Pasta? There was one creator that made one video on how to make this easy Feta Pasta. This went viral. People were making the Feta Pasta. They're talking about the Feta Pasta. The Feta Pasta is being talked about at the dinner table. And Feta Pasta across North America or sorry, Feta across North America sold out. We sold out not a brand of Feta, we sold out Feta. iOS 14.5, the infamous Apple update left D2C brands struggling to find and market to the right audiences. That's why hundreds of D2C brands are turning to Black Crow AI. Their plug and play machine learning technology measures in real time every visitor's likelihood to buy to build predictive audiences for retargeting and prospecting. In short, Black Crow can significantly boost ROAS by helping you specifically target people who will actually want to buy from you. Find out why brands like Magic Spoon, Barabee, and Liquid IV are using Black Crow AI. Visit blackcrow.ai to learn more and request a 30-day free trial. And the inverse is also true. If it's happening in the world, it's also happening on TikTok. So we saw the Oscars a few weeks ago. You guys are going to realize quickly I'm obsessed with Julia Fox. She has like upscaled my entertainment to like a 10x. Uh, so she had a funny uh, soundbite that immediately she was in an interview and she said she was writing her novel and that it was a masterpiece. Oh, Julia. So immediately that became a soundbite. It came onto TikTok. It went viral. People were talking about their different products that they were releasing, they were talking about the food they were making. Everything was a masterpiece with the soundbite. So we're owning those three things. We have community, we have discoverability, and we also have culture. Uh, and something that I've heard before is that we're a really young platform. We're currently over a billion, billion with a B, monthly active users globally. Yeah. Let that set in. Uh, so incredible. So we are so excited and humbled by how far we've come, but also like this is just the beginning. Our company is only about three, not even three years old in North America, so so, so much more to come. 
Uh, so on the platform, a billion people, is it all singing and dancing? <laughs> I've heard this. We have every single topic, category, niche community, everything that you guys can think of is on TikTok. If you're not on TikTok, I challenge you to download it, give it 20 minutes, and it's going to know you better than your mother does. So whether you're into plants, you're into gardening, you're into walking along the seawall, whatever we are into, it is on the platform. It is inclusive. It is unique in that space that it is inclusive and engaging. And we are also very inclusive to brands. Users are looking to discover the new, which includes products and brands that they want to learn more about. So this is my favorite thing to say to brands. Brands are welcome on TikTok. Brands are so welcome on TikTok. We just want you to show up in a way that is authentic to TikTok. Don't show up as advertisers, show up as a part of the community. Learn the TikTok language, be there to converse with people, be in the comments, comment on other people's stuff. Don't wait for, for uh, them to come to you, go to them. Find your audiences and talk to them. So I'm gonna pivot into how we fit into your media mix. And I have some numbers, so I'm going to read them because I didn't remember them. So if somebody has seen an ad on TikTok that includes a brand or a product, and then they watch a TV ad with the same brand or product, their memory encoding is increased by 13%. If a person has seen an ad on TikTok with a brand or product, and then they see a video about that brand or product on YouTube, they're 31% less likely to skip that ad on YouTube. And if you see a video on TikTok, and then you see that same product with an influencer on Instagram, the influencer ad is 43% more memorable. So we are having this halo effect. It's absolutely incredible what we're doing for other platforms because we're so unique and so engaging on our platform and we're complementing the other platforms. And something else we've done because we're spicy, bold, crazy, uh, we have decided that we are absolutely done with the one-way purchase funnel. We've ended it, RIP. We are now into the purchase infinity loop. I'm gonna walk you guys along it, so come for a journey. We're going to take a first step, and I know that it's infinity loop. There's no first step, but we have to start somewhere. So we're going to start in the discover space. We want users to learn about us. Obviously, this is a great space to discover. The users are scrolling their For You feed. We've already discussed that they're engaged. They're excited. They're looking to learn more. We've discovered. Then we go to consideration. This is huge on our platform. Users are doing their research right on platform. So they're coming in. They're going into the comments. Ooh, the comments. <laughs> I've heard some comments on the comments. Uh, they're going into the comments because they want to know what's going on. When they want to know the really real. Is your brand trustworthy? Has anybody else bought it? Has their community bought it? Are your claims authentic? They're going in and they're asking questions to you, the brand. They're asking questions to their community. They're making comments. So be in the comments, respond to them. And if they say something snappy, maybe say something snappy back. It's a fun place to be, the comments. Uh, and they're also going to your organic page. They want to learn more about you. They want to see what else is going on. They want to see the old comments. They want to see if they relate to your brand and your personality. So have your organic page, be in the comments, again, on theme, be part of the community. So we've done discovery, consideration. You then use our TikTok shoppable products to make the purchase. So we have your catalog there. Uh, we can have your product details there. Uh, purchase is currently happening off platform, but more to come on that. Uh, and then we continue on. So unique to our platform. So we're continuing on then to your reviews and your participation. This is the sweet spot. This is amazing. Somebody has bought your product. They're like, their value proposition is exactly what they promised. This is what I wanted. I want to go talk about it. They want to talk to your brand. They want to say, I absolutely love it. Thank you. They want to talk to other people. You should get this. I absolutely love it. And sometimes they even want to make videos about your product because they want to be seen and heard and they want to share with their community as well. So 
I've thrown a lot at you. I know I wouldn't talk too much about TikTok, but the three takeaways I want to share with you guys as you walk out the door. The first one, what makes us different? And how are you guys going to show up as part of the community? So it was our community, our culture, and our discoverability. The second thing is my favorite infinity loop that I drew in the air for all y'all. Uh, and then the third thing is come to the platform authentically. We are real, raw, authentic. That's always going to champion over polished, high gloss. Again, get down there. Be in the comments. Be with the people. You are part of the community. You're not talking at audiences. We're now talking with audiences. So that is all my TikTok talk. Uh, if you guys do want to learn more about TikTok, you know, getting into strategy is so unique to every brand. So I'd love to chat with all of you guys. Uh, and I also work very closely with Pilot House. And like, this is totally unprompted. This is from my own free will. But Pilot House is part of DTC's network. And they are an amazing agency that gets TikTok. So if you're like, I need a hand. I don't really know. They are fantastic. I'm happy to chat with you guys. Reach out to them. Uh, but thank you guys so much. Incredible to see everybody. And looking forward to chatting even more. Thanks so much for listening to today's episode. If you're not a subscriber to our newsletter, you can do that right now at direct to consumer all one word, dot co. I'm Eric Dick, and this has been the D2C Podcast. We'll see you next time.